The thing that I don't get is is why it's so uh, earth shattering. <laughs> like it's just such a big thing now. Like oh my god, uh, let's stop the press. Let's stop everything we're doing. Don't even let the kids go to school today. A guy said uh, we were going to wear dresses, so the world needs to stop everything they're doing because, oh, so many women are offended by it. I just don't believe that. I don't believe that. And this guy wrote that all these women he works with are offended. Like, give me a break. you got to be kidding me. Really? I mean, don't you have something better to do with your day than, like, really try to sell me that you're offended by that so much that it affects your day? I just don't get it. Like... How could that really, like, look, you, you, you know as many tough women as I do. I'm not going to sit here. But <laughs> my wife would no more care if someone said that than fly a kite. I mean, honestly, like, really? She'd laugh and be like, whatever, dude. <laughs> whatever. But really, you're going to stop everything? I know many journalists that are completely offended by this, and it's affected their ability to go to work. <laughs> They just can't even begin to start their day. They need a day off because of this. This has ruined the future of women. <laughs> the whole process has been set back five years, for Christ's sakes. Someone's got to stop it. We all have to learn how to love one another and treat each other equally. And yes, it is! What? What? Do you want him to go to jail? <laughs> you have said something bad about women wearing dresses. You will be crucified. I don't think. You know what? Can, do you think Earl Weaver would have taken it back? Would Billy Martin have taken it back?